the video you will see only on two, a man strapped to a stretcher and taken to the hospital after police say he tried to fight them. Yeah, police say a standoff with that man ended when he jumped out of a window and then he tried to get into a fight with officers. This all happened on Rutland and West 12th Street in the Heights. Channel 2's Bill Spencer live now where this happened. Really scary moments for officers there, Bill. Jonathan Sion, absolutely horrifying. In fact, police believe this man was high on some kind of ultra powerful narcotic drug because he was so out of control. In fact, he jumped right through one of the second story windows. And even with the SWAT team in place, this man chose to take on the police. Uh, he, j he was arguing with them. He was screaming at them. He was kicking at them, even biting them. Shattered windows and shattered nerves at Rutland and West 12th Street tonight in the Heights as SWAT team members, guns drawn, surrounded this upstairs garage apartment. Inside, a man with a gun breaking out the windows and screaming at police. This is exclusive video of that man tied up and finally being transported to the hospital afterwards. Our officers arrived on scene. They tried to make contact with him. Uh, one of our officers actually made contact with him and they saw him uh, with a handgun and he actually racked the handgun and then he went back inside the apartment. It all began about 5.15 Sunday evening. A woman believed to be the man's girlfriend called 911 saying her boyfriend was armed, was throwing things out the windows and going crazy, yelling about wanting to see his grandmother. With the SWAT team in position with guns trained on the apartment and the gunman, Houston police say the gunman suddenly jumped through one of those plate glass windows to get to the cops below. And this guy jumped out of a two-story window to the, co to, up to the officers below. That is correct. That is correct. For reasons unknown, he made the decision to jump through the window. Once on the ground, that gunman, shown here hogtied and being lifted into an ambulance, started kicking and biting the officers, trying to get away. He struggled, became very combative, he became very belligerent. Uh, at one point, uh, he did bite one of the officers. Uh, he's been checked out, he's going to be fined. Uh, the suspect's being transported, obviously, when he jumped. He's going to be transported to Bentov for evaluation. Now, you're looking at just some of the glass that rained down on the officers below. Now, they have this man in custody. Obviously, he's, he's at the hospital right now. But as soon as doctors are through with him, they say he is going to be charged with two counts of aggravated assault of a police officer for biting one officer in the leg for kicking another officer right in the face. Reporting live in the Heights, Bill Spencer, KPRC, Channel 2 News.